Okay, hi everyone. Um, in this video, we're going to show you how to upload your content for your virtual uh, activity or sports fair stall. Um, so first of all, head over to the Students' Union website, uh, click on My Account and sign in using your University of Sheffield account. You'll then come back to our site and you'll be signed in like this and you'll have an option for Clubs and Society Dashboard, which you should click on and that will take you here you'll land on this page um, so this will be you good afternoon and hello I'm Chris uh, as you can see um, and this will display your club or society that you're a committee member of so the first thing to do is click on manage and you can see this is all changed show you the other uh, committee members that have permissions if you scroll down on the left here I'm on an iPad so it's sometimes a little bit funky um, and you see fairs if you click on that and you might have a f there might be some more options here because we're in test mode at the moment because we're building the fairs for you at the moment um, so that pick the fair that your stall is on and it will be clearly labeled um, so you click on view now this are all oh, these are all the fields that are for your stall um, and you have to upload or add content to these fields and then they're submitted and um, myself and Sanchari, who are um, the digital support team for uh, societies and clubs, will approve all these as quickly as we can. We can't promise it will be um, in minutes or hours, but we can uh, certainly hope to do it the next day at the absolute latest. But the sooner you do it, uh, the better, and we can get that all approved for you. Um, and ready for the fair and you once they're approved you get this green approved badge um, the first one is video which we'd highly recommend you do and it'll become obvious when I show you the, uh, what your page um, what the stalls pages look like in a minute um, so you do this via YouTube uh, it's an iframe bit of code if you click on there there's a guide from YouTube of how to do it. it's really nice and simple you just copy the code from uh, underneath your YouTube video and paste it there press submit and your video will be at the top um, the about um, section so this is text uh, it can be anything you like up to one to three paragraphs we'd recommend um, remember you've also got a uh, society or club page as well on uh, the SU website so this should complement that really but this is probably the first thing in the virtual fair that a student would see so just include uh, things that would um, they would need to know and would um, make them excited to want to know a bit more about your society um, press submit and you get a lot of green submitted there um, and then once that's approved uh, it will go live on your store these last two are optional so you can upload an image and that might be an image of you uh, guys as the committee or it might be an image of one of your activities or events um, or the type of thing that you do and similarly you might have a document like a pdf um, that, uh, or a poster even um, for for this one uh, and a document of any kind uh, that you want to upload here and here and you just drag and drop, pop them in, um, and they'll get uploaded, and we need to approve those as well. So I'm going to show you now um, what the fair looks like from a student view. So um, first of all, um, we'll do lots of promotion to uh, let students know about the fairs. This is day one, so Monday the 21st of September is the first virtual fair, and it's departmental and medical societies and who uh, those stores will change each day a student just signs in using their University of Sheffield account um, underneath are the other fairs coming up later in the week and then we just need to so we're building these pages at the moment so they're not live um, but they will be so I'm giving you a nice sneaky preview of what they look like so this uh, when they've signed in they'll come here and this is where they can view all the stalls and you can see there's two main views the stalls which is this one and there's an a to z guide um, 
so you swipe left and right here or if you're on a phone you can um, you can just use your finger um, and then underneath you've got view society store page which I'll show you shortly and then or view society page so that's what I mean about you've got both and we've imported your um, logo and description and social media links from the old SU website onto your version of this page. So that's the store. Um, the next screen I'm going to show you uh, is the A to Z guide. I just need to flip between our two apps. So signed in as a student and we're in A to Z guide. These are an alphabetical list of all the societies or clubs that are on the virtual fair that day. So dead straightforward, you can just click on the names and go through to the store page, which I will show you now, which you can see looks a bit like that. Let's show you nice and big as it would look. Okay, so this is it. So this is your store page. So you can see here how um, the name of your society back to all the stores if you wanted to do that as a student. So they can browse around. They can join your group if you've got a membership set up or they could register your interest. Now, register your interest is automatically set up for you. Um, and if a student clicks on that, it um, adds their email address to your student dashboard so you can then email them whenever you like. Um, oh, sorry, it's just being a bit glitchy there. So there's your video. Uh, and you can see from the swipe left, swipe right why the video is important uh, and you should do that if you can um, and then a little bit about your society if you upload an image um, it's in the good to know section we've uh, uploaded the bar one house rules um, but it can be a picture of activity you're up to or have been up to or like I say uh, anything you like really relating to your society if you've uploaded a document it will show here and they can click on that and view that in their phone or on their browser. Also, you see this little um, blue round circle with a little smiley face. This is live chat. Now, every society and club will have the live chat function on their page, and we'll give you permissions to a another live chat dashboard or a live chat dashboard, so you can be the other on the other end of the chat. I'll just show you this. Uh, briefly uh, how it looks um, so this isn't obviously isn't a society's uh, store page but just to show you the chat it's this little icon you click on it the student just needs to put in their name email address and message press submit and then it opens a live chat and then you as a committee on the day that you're doing your virtual fair will be on the other end of that chat and you can chat away to any student that um, gets in touch that way. So you can both capture emails via the register your interest and you can do the live chat on the day as well. And then, so let's show you where that is in your dashboard. So again, orientation of these fields, your video is here, the about us um, description stuff is here and images or documents are uploaded on the three and four option now to get to those registered interests one you click on members over here uh, and then you can see you've got all members which any memberships that you had so lifetime memberships or two or three year memberships on the old SU website will have been imported over for you um, and then we've got interested members up here and these are the people that have clicked that uh, register your interest button and you'll have a list of all of those and to contact them you click on here and this is a nice simple form first of all select your group so you can see you can contact all your members your committee members um, and interested members select that click next and then you can put in a subject test Hi, lovely to have you. Obviously, put in a, a longer message than that. Um, if you wanted to add an attachment, you can click that toggle um, and you can do that on the next screen. I'm not going to do that this time. Next. 
uh, and then you're done really if your message is right so you can click back to just check that that's okay and that's how you want it and you might want to send it to your committee first so to check this comes out okay um, but once you're happy press finish green tick boom it's been sent um, so you can send those whenever you like and communicate with students that are interested in your society nice and simple I hope that was useful obviously rewind pause um, and have a look at this video to orientate yourself but the main thing is to get those stall uploads done here uh, and then they can be approved and your stall will be ready to roll thanks for watching